Did you notice how I I aided you this morning? I got the I got the uh, restream all set up for you, so you oh. have to do it. Wasn't that nice? Nice. I'm here I for always you. You know that. on days in which we're streaming. I have a task at around 10 a.m. my time to set up OBS so that I'll have it ready. So when I opened OBS 30 minutes ago, I pondered whether or not I did that. So now I know. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, man, did I, did I forget already? That sounds more like me than you. Okay. Did I lose you guys? Oh, I did. No, I didn't. Okay. The one thing I always do when we start streaming is that I go to YouTube on my phone and try to see, first of all, how big of a delay do we have? It seems that that nine seconds delay. And second, I want to make sure that we're streaming at 30 frames per second. That's good to know. I'm, I'm glad you told me that. That's uh, I was worried that it was more like eight frames per second and that would have that been horrible. Well, we had that once, and we had to stop the stream and restart oh. it. Well, then, then my my snarkiness doesn't make sense then, because it, it would actually suck if it, that happened. Mm -hmm. Okay, never mind. I won't make. I take back my making fun. So, first of all, nine seconds is not such a big a delay, if you ask me, especially if we're streaming in the full HD. But Doesn't it usually, does the HD usually take up, pick up later? I thought they couldn't do it right away. So, we're streaming in the HD, and that's the reason for the delay, because it takes longer for encoding and then uploading the frames. And even though I got a fiber connection, you've got that delay to make sure that you don't have any glitches or buffering during the stream itself. Uh, okay. For example, you're always streaming at 720p. You're not streaming in full HD. When you yeah, it, look so. like, it looks like crap. Yeah. Okay. All right. Bye. Hello, and welcome to Tech Talk with Daniel. I, I mean, uh, Conversations with Curtis. How's it going, everybody? Happy Monday. Happy Monday. I almost said Friday. We did that already. Uh, good to see you. Thanks for joining. And uh, we're going to be playing some more Toonstruck today with uh, Mr. Noah Antweiler and Daniel Albu and I. Um, but meanwhile, how is everybody? I'm seeing the gang. I'm seeing Ozzy and Tybron was our... First one here, it looks like. Joseph Darian, welcome. Jackson Jin, welcome. That's another name I don't know. Um Raccoon's here and uh, Velvet TK. Good to see you guys. Yeah. I uh, hope you're all doing well. Hope you all had a good weekend. And uh, let's get right to it, shall we? Uh, thanks all to all of our, our Patreon and Coffee members for making conversations with Curtis possible. And we have a new uh, member of our coffee slash patreon family gin rummy joined recently thank you gin rummy for being a part of a new member of the family we were happy and thrilled that you're here and thanks so much for supporting us if you want to join gin rummy and everybody else here you can do that as well uh, we'll certainly uh, accept your support if you can if you ha or have the means to do so uh, otherwise uh, you could always just give us a one-time goal one-time donation to fulfill our daily goal uh, through coffee.com. And if you're new to us, uh, we do appreciate any donation you give, but coffee.com allows us to keep most of the money you give us, where if you do a super chat, 
it actually takes up to 50% uh, for themselves, which isn't, isn't very nice, especially if you're trying to help us out. So use coffee.com. And if you do, and if you do it enough, you get into our top seven donors, which uh, for the last 30 days is Jouex at number one, Girlfan at number two, CJ at number three, CompuArt, Doppelganger, Top Fuel, and YT Wander. So, uh, so there you go. And before I bring out Noah and Daniel, uh, Darian Chiba says he just finished watching the eclipse. How was it? Did you get a good? Did he get, did he get a good view? Uh, we don't. We don't have any. We have a cloud cover today, and no visibility. We're just not in the right location to see it. So, I'd love to hear more. Um, yeah, troll me by giving a thousand through super chat. That would be really good for YouTube. Um, but thanks for joining. Um, yeah, curious about the. If we, uh, let's bring out Daniel and, and Noah. We can chat more. Wow. Hey, everybody, how's it going? Hey, hey. well, welcome. How was your weekend? Uh, just fine. Um, <clears throat> been watching more movies. I watched Spider Man Across the Spider Verse. What'd you think? I liked it a lot. Um, did, did you like the? Did you see the first one? I'm sure you did, right? Yeah, into the into the Spider Verse. Yeah, I saw that one too. Um, uh, also, like it's it's it, it counts on my quest to watch more Academy Award winning movies because Into the Spider Verse won for Best Animated Feature. Mm -hmm. So yeah, uh, yeah. I, I don't. Really I have much loved more to the it, first though. one. I loved the first one. Just we watched it a bunch of times, uh -huh. and the second one to me. It just didn't. It, it was too um, frenetic. It too just much. never. It never stopped. I, I mean, what I liked about the first one is there was more character development. There was more humor. There was more, you know, sort of. But this one, it was just like go, go, go. There was. It was just even the humor was all happening within an action sequence, and it just went on and on for me to the point that I'm like, ah, oh, just give me a. I needed a little bit of a breather. I actually I agree. Be, I agree. Yeah. There was one point where they're running up a building or some structure, or they're sliding down it or something, and that scene it's like goes a, on. It's like a train, yeah. And it just goes on and on and on, and I'm like, enough already. It's you, I get it, you know. So, I I definitely think it is not a superior follow up to the first. That's my that's my thought. Daniel, yeah, did I, you see I it? For the first, yeah. No, I have not. It's on okay, my well, watch list. But yeah. I, I wanted to talk to Noah mm -hmm. about his tweet about Matrix Resurrections. I mean, when I watched it the first time, I was so yeah. disappointed that I don't think that a second watch would rectify the situation because my issue with the movie is not the plot or it's the the visual effects are so amateurish. I mean, you think it, so? Yeah, I mean mm. the second, the first, second, and third movies, which were released twenty years prior to that, seem to have better visual effects than the movie that was released in twenty twenty. I, I I agree to a certain extent. I wouldn't say they're amateurish, but I think like each one of those movies, the previous movies, had a big set piece that was something really, really epic and something memorable. Like Matrix Reloaded had the burly brawl with the hundred agent Smiths. Mm -hmm. Stuff, something like that. Uh, stuff that is really, really memorable. And I don't think Matrix Resurrections had anything like that. Uh, it it was it had it had its own action, and it was and the action was all good, but it wasn't anything uh, like that. To on the level, nothing of it. Nothing about it was on the level of the previous movies, like the like the 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 uh, the, the martial arts or anything like that. Um, yeah, but usually the Matrix movies used to be groundbreaking in terms of CGI and sure. this one wasn't I mean was it the I same people was it um was it the same uh, same director makers? yeah same director one of the directors and two of the lead actors and no agent smith and no morpheus and i agree with negrus in the in the chat i think the second matrix was the best i really liked it people hate it but I really liked it. I, it. I I actually I like the second one just fine. It's the third one I can't stand. Yeah, uh, I can't stand the movies. third one. Just don't call it Matrix anything if you're not in the Matrix for the majority of the movie. Thanks. 
<laughs> Daniel. <laughs> Outside the Matrix, it should have been called. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, dudes, let's play some uh, tune struck today. So, all right. Noah, can you give us the the, the sum up? Um. Well, our hero is a is an animator whose name I can't remember. His last name Drew is Blank. Blank. Drew Blank. Drew Blank. Drew Blank. Because, yeah. Who has missed his uh who has missed his last three dentist appointments, but that's the least of his problems in that he needs to draw a new uh series of companions for fluffy fluffy bun bun. Right, right. His his was... award winning character. And uh whatever, he's now dreaming and he's in this toonstruck world where he or, is or he got sucked into a TV in real life and he's He's not dreaming, and this is actually happening. We right. don't know. We'll find out. Right. And Doctor Nefarious or Lord Nefarious, I can't remember which one, uh, is using some kind of uh, uh, angrifying ray right. to turn everything ugly. <laughs> and so we need to build a cutifier right. to make things cute again. I mean, yeah, they could good. have thought of you more make this. You make this names. sound. I will say though, hearing Noah tell me the story of something we've all experienced so it's just i get it now i mean i i need you to just keep you know keep narrating along the way because it just makes more sense when i okay so just... later that might have been yeah. it. the malevolator is that one that might anyway have been. all right so are you gonna give uh no other controls daniel yep 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 okay Wait. i want to play at some point during the day it doesn't have to be yeah. now but later by on, all no. means okay Okay, so Paul, you play for yes. an hour, and then Noah will play for an hour. That sounds like a plan. Oh, okay. Am I going first? Oh, really? Yeah. No, I'm scared. All right. You should be. It's all new to me. I don't know what the uh, controls are, so I'm. It's just, it's um, nothing major. You just click. Just okay. Yeah. And we talked. So, okay, gotcha. You're, you're and we talked to him already, right? Um, yeah, we he's did. The, he's the carecrow. So let's go. Let's go this way. We'll get a get, get a thing of corn. Oh, look, come back. Get a thing of corn. Okay, sounds good. Good call. Oh, I don't know what to do. No, I think... I'm sure it wouldn't have heard. He waited for... Him. What's his face to join him? Okay, then what do I... Place it in the put... bottomless pit. Okay, there it is. Nice. So what about the bird? Do I do anything with the birds? No, nope. okay, now I can go, yeah? Yeah. They got him walking the whole way. All right. Okay, we got some people. We got some stuff. What's this? I think it's broken. There's a part missing. All right. Can't grab. Can't look. Sure it just does it. Does it tell yeah. you? Everything goes to immediate grab. Can I choose the? No, it doesn't because there are some things that. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. So okay, it, oh, it's it will a tell you. Churn. What... It'll tell you what your options are. Yeah. It says Turbo Butter Churnatron 2000. Okay. In there. Churnatron. Yeah. Oh, oh I can't. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. What's he doing? Yeah, sh shove oh. him in the acid. Oh. Just like I look at Judge Doom. All right, let's go. Um, okay, so let's, I guess we talked to a cow. Do you have anything up here? No, let's talk to the cow. Hello, ladies. Psst, Drew, let me handle this. I'm a whiz with foreign languages. No! Mama be do! Hubba hubba, ring a ding ding, kawabanga! Are you speaking to us? Icebreaker. Drew, oh, you must want some butter. I'm terribly sorry, but there isn't any more. None at all. This looks pretty full. Uh, no, we... You see, <laughs> the Chernatron is broken. Chernatron. Hey, no big deal. I know how upset you must be. Without butter, life is barely worth living. So we're going to have to make All some butter. That's my guess. Utopia mourns my pure, sweet, creamery butter. Unhappy day. Unhappy day. But we will soldier on. And you must as well. Courage. So we need to get a part 
that fix here. Do I need to keep talking Say, to her? Aren't you ladies supposed to be on all fours? <gasps> oh, Whoa. oh, the nerve! <laughs> oh my god. Well, you asked whether oh, no, no, or not no, no, it's no, a no, kid friendly that's, game. That's not what I meant. It's <laughs> not. It's not. Whoa. It's just that in my world, uh, forget it. Uh, I, I, I'm really sorry. I, I didn't mean to offend you. Well, anyone with the good manners to apologize is welcome in our stable. By the way, but that was an honest too, mistake, so it's not. It doesn't. It's, uh, We're a it's still kind of I'm mild. Marge, and this is Polly, and this machine is my lifelong friend and partner, the Chernatron. It's a pleasure to meet all of you. Okay, so now ice is is the ice. It's not quite. Do I have to melt all the ice? Do I have to exhaust I, all of the? Uh, um, I would imagine so, but I don't know. Uh, yeah, I might as well just do it. Did you say the Trinitron okay. was broken? Yes, I'm afraid the poor thing is on the fritz and has been for quite some time. Oh, it seems like an eternity since my last milking. I don't mind telling you that my rosy red swollen udders are in desperate uh. need of a good suck suck sucking from old journey here. Actually, I mind you telling me that. You see, we were uh. a team. This is going Together, great. <laughs> we made the sweetest, purest butter in all of Qtopia. Without my partner in cream, all I have left are my memories. Look, I'm sure it's oh a real gosh. shame about Mr. Suck Suck here. But there's more to life than butter. Right, Drew? All right. I mean, you've got this quaint little barn to live in and all the hay you could ever want and, and uh, flocks. Did we mention this lovely barn? Ooh, besides, you could have a career in the beef business. A short one, of course. It's sweet of you to try to cheer us up. But butter is my life. Until the Chernatron is fixed, things just won't be the same. I just wish we knew what we were supposed to do around here. That goes away. So this the great thing about Tron. this user interface is that you can see that you have more quiet. icebreaker lines Elmer, running yes. to the Elmer's icon itself. Special. special. Yeah. You know, it's a nice silo, but it isn't holding any grain. If you grasp my meaning. <sighs> no grain. Grain? Okay, I just so figured he was a total retard or something. Sorry, lady. Retard. <laughs> special. He suffers from foot and mouth disease, if you grasp my meaning. <laughs> huh? Oh my! I don't quite get that whole thing. What was good? That was a lot of effort. So, uh, what exactly happened to the Trinitron anyway? I'm afraid it may have broken down from simple overuse. I do so enjoy making butter. One minute it was working fine, churning away. Then all of a sudden, a metal thingamabob flew off. We looked everywhere, but we couldn't find it. If only we had a way of getting that part. Well, Without it, my life is don't you worry. You know, Marge, we'll cancel meaning, Flux. Purpose, all that stuff is overrated. <laughs> Hell, just ask Flux here. His life is completely pointless, and he's loving every minute of it. You bet your sweet bippy. As a revered Zanian philosopher once said, those who seek meaning in their lives are... What the? Ah! He was run over by a runaway ice cream truck before completing his last work. But for all us Sanians, there is profound meaning to be found in his senseless, untimely death. I know what you're trying to do, and I thank you. You're good people. But I'm afraid for a domesticated bovine. Life is empty when you have a sack full of souring milk. Amen. This, ho okay. this whole scene is highly disturbing to me. <laughs> yeah. We're done with that, right? Uh-huh. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's go look so for the long, bolt. Ladies. We have to move along. Move along? Get it? That's a very bad joke. Are they making fun of us? Of course not, Polly. These are our friends. Whew. Comments like that make me feel like I'm about three feet high. You are about three feet high. Cool. For a second there, I thought I developed a conscience. Working on so. Oh, can I talk to him? Is anybody home? Just answer yay or nay. <coughs> and we have our answer. Straight from the horse's mouth. All right, all right. Uh, what do we need to do? Get out of here? We look in our. Uh, we have to look around, right? Do we have to move? We got to do something with the super veggie girl. That's got to be important. Oh, yeah. Let's check and see what that I'm is. not going to stick my hand in there. 
But what can I do with it? Inventory. Maybe check your like bottomless a... bag. Okay, so we have red herring. We got a watering can. Yeah. How do, but... do I put it in the star? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. But can it withstand? It's fertilizer. Oh, wow. Yeah, I guess so. Huh. Wow. Okay, okay, so now that's good. We got that. All right. What do we need that for? Super veggie grow. Well, we need Let's it for, try. I don't know. That's a good question. You're not going to let me in, huh? Okay, can I go this way? No place else to go. All right, so we have to get out of here, I guess. What's this? Do you have anything in your inventory that may be considered useless. I a missing know, part from the Trinitron? Uh, Maybe that oh, chain? Veggie grow. We can do the this with this is a vegetable. Can you? It's a corn you, cob, not a plant. Oh, okay. Put it back. So he's telling us he's being clear about what we can't do. Uh, I don't think there's anything here to use yet. Do you? No, I don't think so. How do I get out of here? Just hit the. Okay. So. Um, <laughs> what? Reese's tipped five dollars. Let me pop your donation cherry for the week, and I'll say I'm really happy to see you three together again. Hey, Reese's, thank you so much. Appreciate that. Thanks for thank getting you. things started. Um. Okay. Uh, oh, what at this thing? Let's just look at this. It looks okay. like some sort of suction device. Boy, I sure okay. would hook myself up to that thing. No, I way. would. Uh -uh. You think she'd mind? So Molly in the uh, chat wrote, Hey Noah, I watched your content since I went to high school. Thank you for everything you've done. It helped me to get through some hard times. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Oh, uh, no, no. Okay, so I have to stay in there. There's really nothing. Well, there's another there's, path down why? to the south. We still, we still can have locations to explore. Maybe one of... Maybe we can use the fertilizer and something. Oh, yeah, Probably. yeah. On the Whoa. But this I was thinking new. we would I was thinking we were looking for that bolt. I thought that would have to be in that location. So I guess it'll be somewhere oh, else. True. Pissed off squirrel. A nasty looking squirrel. I don't think the squirrel oh. will let me do that. Okay, we gotta get this we gotta distract the squirrel. Let's go get the pepper. We'll throw the squirrels. I can't pick that pepper while that briar patch is in the way. They have oh something my gosh, to, we got a lot of stuff to do here. That now. briar patch? No. Yes, we do not. No. <laughs> uh, what else is going on There's here? There's a tree. There's a door in the tree. Door in the tree. Oh, yeah, yeah. There we go. The door to the squirrel's tree house. That's it? That's all I got? That's it. Oh, wow. It's way darker over here. Um, all right, do we want to go here yet? I don't think we're ready to go here yet. Let's go back. Yeah, let's, let's go back. I want to explore this little area first. Okay, so we've got... Uh, we got to somehow get rid of the squirrel so we can get the nuts. So we also need to get the peppers, but we got to move the briar patch. Mm-hmm. So we'll need some scissors or whatever. What's this? That's where I live. So that's going to take us all the way over there. Okay. Well, do we do this now? Or do we want to... Yeah. Imagery. I guess so. I guess the nut's not up for grabs. The nut's not up for grabs. All right. What's with the... Oh, we have to... I bet you we have to put another nut in here. Mm. I think you need two nuts, is my guess. Yep. We're going to go in there. How will we get a nut from the... Angry squir squirrel. Yes. He's not going to let us go. He's going to say. Give me a nut. Well, technically speaking, we're somewhere, but I guess it's not the somewhere you had in mind. Okay. So. Uh, how do I get out of here? Next Wait, minute. Paul, have you ever seen a solar eclipse? Uh, I saw the one that was um, 
It was like five or six years ago, right? Maybe even a little bit more. Um, or was that a lunar eclipse? I don't remember. It was in the middle of the day. I, yeah, we had a big one a while back that I was able to, we got glasses and we all went outside during work and took a look at it. Did you hear animals howling? No. Well, are you trying to give me a hint or something? What are you talking no. about? No. Oh, use the, oh. Uh, use the mouse. Elephants are afraid of mice. Where is the mouse? Oh, we have a mouse? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We bonked it with a hammer. Right, so good call. Okay, so put the mouse up here. The mouse won't be too scary from 20 feet away. Okay. The hand. Oh, good call. Okay. So the reason I mentioned the animals was because when I saw a, a solar eclipse back in 1999, all I remember from it is the fact that dogs were howling throughout the eclipse. Hi there, Jumbo! What's up beside you, of course? <laughs> yeah, no, I don't... I, yeah, I don't remember animals howling. Uh, okay, I need to some, somehow... How do I get this thing to move? What do I do? I use the. Now use oh, the, I have to go the, in. Okay, I have to go into the thing. And then I gotta go. Yeah, there we go. He's not looking too good. I don't think he's gonna make it. I guess the old terrifying elephant with a small rope trick doesn't work with an unconscious mouse. Yeah. Oh, Puppet, boy, we got work to do here. Pop it full of adrenaline or something. What? Do we have adrenaline? No, we don't. Okay. Uh, we give him know. that... I don't know how to wake it up, but uh, let's see. Okay, let's uh, let's go. Do we have it? Do we have anything in our inventory? Maybe we, do we have cheese? Can we get cheese from somewhere? No, we just have a red herring, a corn, a rental voucher mm. for a costume, and a gold chain, and a music box. Um, how do we move the? We, I know what we have to do. We have to distract him. We have to uh, wake up the mouse. We have to get the briar patch out of the way. Um, but what are we? Oh, what's this? Nothing here. It's like a little ledge. It's a cliff. Yeah, it's a cliff. What, what's with the door? Do what's with the door? Yeah. The door to the squirrel's treehouse. Oh, okay. But it doesn't let us go to it or anything like that. So should we go into the dark area over to the left here? Do we need the cutifier for the squirrel? Do we have a cutifier? I don't know, but it seems like we don't have it. the other thing we have is this thing, and that's gonna grow that's gonna grow vegetables a little later. Um What's that pink note? How do I look at it? A free rental voucher from the costume shop. Let's go Sweet to the costume shop. Utopian corn. Where's the costume shop? Go back. Okay, so that means go back this way, right? Mm -hmm. We tried using the voucher already. It has to be. It has to be stamped by the king. Oh. oh. And do okay. we give it to the king? We can't get in to see the king. He's locked his door. This is Fluffy Fluffy Bun Bun. This is the one, this is the, wasn't she like all jacked up on, she seemed like all st strained out, right? Um, okay, do you want to talk to her again? No, I don't, but let's Hello, do it. Hello, Fluffy. Oh boy, my special friends are back. Drew, if I ever get like that, shoot me. So, human okay. convertible in the chat says they do have what they need to wake him up. So why don't you try everything in your inventory on the mouse to see what works? Okay. Sounds good. Uh, how do I get out of here? Never mind. I forgot what I was going to say. Maybe you just...
just wanted to see the sunshine play off my pretty fur. <laughs> oh boy, I'm gonna walk over here just to get All a right. little farther away. Just want to move off to the side. There we go. Okay, now we'll put. Uh, we if we want to wake up the mouse. Yeah, let's go to the corn. That, that particular screen and just try everything on the mouse. See what. Oh, works. the screen back where the where the thing is. Where, where, the, the... where the mouse is. Yeah, the mouse is. Okay. We out of here. Oh, there we go. Yep. Other way. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's my. I like that you can quickly change your mind. I love the fact that they added shadow beneath. Yeah. Lloyd, because they didn't do it in any of the in Phantasmagoria <laughs> one, and I think but it's that just a. It, it's not really a shadow. It's just a, a circle. Yeah, but it adds okay. a sense of realism that you don't have in Phantasmagoria one. Let's give him some corn. I think this shuttle has its hands full already. Well, no, I'll give it to him. Okay, hand holding yeah, mouse. Yeah. The shuttle has its hands full okay. already. Okay. Right. How about red herring? We can give him the. Use the this? fertilizer. Cool. Yeah. Fertilizer. Seems weird. That, that's animal it's, cruelty, it's but sure. Little it's, fella, but it's time to wake up and smell the Oh, jeez. What? Okay. It's, it's stinky. Yeah. Uh, that's it? All right, now yeah. I can I think go in there. It. Yeah, it's awake. That was, that was easy. That that was a little. No, oh, I don't know. A little moon logicy. We're going to Zany Doo. I love going to Zany Doo. Nice. Are we there yet? So we didn't need another nut. We still oh, have great. to figure Toontown. out. Well, see, here's the thing: when we play, here's where, here's where my brain goes: is that I am like, oh, I didn't know I wanted to go here. This seems so far away. I still wanted to explore those other places, and including that dark part of the forest. But now I feel like I missed it. I know we'll get a chance to go back, but it, it feels yeah. I, I never now, understood which, that because you always go? because especially with point and click adventure games, you have to explore all available locations to make sure that you don't have anything that you need over there for right, a different but, puzzle. But And I think this is a good thing. I'm not complaining about it, but it's messing with my brain. Like, you know, I've already seen a location that I want to explore, but then I I went to the right, and now it's taking me to another location even farther away. So that that's where I feel like I've gotten... And now I have to make a choice between three roads, and that's that's too much to bear. Yeah. Let's talk to this. Vultures make me nervous when they hang around like that. Okay. Am I gonna go on the? Can't go across the thing. Flux wildly. What's that? Pick something up. I don't think the vulture will let me. Well, then why do you have me? Why do you give that to me as an option? A signpost. I don't think okay. the vulture will let me. Hmm. They have Thoughts, something gentlemen? to give the vulture? Oh, yeah, probably a red herring. I keep forgetting about the inventory. I think he'd prefer red meat. Oh, dang it. Okay, fine. Do it's we have try. red meat? We do not have red meat. Fertilizer. Um... All right, can we go? We probably have to come back here, is my guess. Unless you guys tell me differently, I'm going back the other way. Mm. Right, so we, it's always good to explore. Whoa! Oh, is this our. Yeah, that's the first time it. we've seen the evil dude? Is this Tim Curry? Who's that? It is I, your malevolence. A thousand You're pardons, but I have detected a new presence in Qtopia. I don't have time for more news of rabbits. I have work. This is no rabbit. I've never sensed any creature quite like this before. I see. Is it, um, 
Ding this is kind of like the Monkey harmless. Island. Uh, the, the... So far. Good, good, but keep watching it. I'm not in the mood for meddlers. The pirate I need guy. Time to recharge the machine for my next Chuck? strike. Yeah, a little yes, bit. This has a little Chuck vibe. Yeah, the animation is great. I mean, it seems like, I don't know, 24 frames per second. It is good. What about those eyes? Are we supposed to do something with them? All right, let's go. What do we got here? Gyms. All right, we can talk to this dude. Excuse me, sir. Outhouse security. I'll have to ask you gentlemen to step away from the rest facility. Oh, yeah? Or else what? Citizens in my capacity as an outhouse security professional, this flushing establishment and its surroundings are within my jurisdiction. In short, from where you stand, I am the law. As such, I am authorized to deal with scoundrels, gangsters, charlatans, miscreants, rapscallions, He's got and fish on his shoulders. the troublemakers as I see fit. This would include mercilessly beating you about the head with the shovel. I think we better just do whatever he says. <laughs> I swear, if it wasn't for the fact that I'm a pitiful coward, I'd step back a few feet and flip him off. Big time! All right, I like that guy. And he's got two fish. I, Why I have to say, I don't quite understand the fish. I don't understand the fish. Will we ever understand the fish? Just is that going to... Sure well, the bleeding. fish are Bye -bye. his ranks. Yeah, but... what? And there's fish up here. I'm trying to leave here. Let's go. So we can't go in there. We have to go into the back. I bet you we'll come out the other way. Nice. Now, see all these rooms. Okay, what to do? Some hazardous looking gymnastics equipment. Uh, talk to that dude. Grab some of this stuff. He's not gonna let us. Stop right there, worm like insect. Yeah, oh, it's Arnold. Club members, you are barely fit to look at it, let alone touch its shiny chrome. Is that Jim? Hi there, I'm Drew. This is my friend Flux. Oh look, two scrawny stick figures have wandered accidentally into my world famous gym by accident. You two are obviously looking for the dress shop down the street. You will recognize it by the sign reading, Yes, girls, come inside now. We have petite oh. sizes. Oh, goody, man. Well, that's... Oh, All right, that's oh boy. You know, uh, <laughs> that sweaty dog smell is kind of getting to me. We'll have to talk some other time. What? Come back to the gym membership and come to pop you up. Talk to this. You can't talk to the cat. What's there to do? Can I give him something? Give a dog a bone? Uh, they tell us that things that you can click on have the title or the name or the description written at the bottom. Oh, the, this thing just... This thing just... It stomps uh, all over the cat, yeah. Stomps over the cat. Ah. There's, oh, there's something. I can't go there because it'll stop me. Bumpotron. There's a thing up there. What am I telling you? That machine is for club members only. Look at that. What's he doing? Ow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. What, what do we do here? Uh, nothing, I guess. The Malevolator. Oh, this is all of our stuff, right? No, this is the stuff we need to accumulate in order to create the Malevolator. Oh, it's all right. We need to get the opposite of those things, actually. We need to get... Yeah, exactly. Right. A royal music box, complete with an embossed portrait of King Hugh on the lid. A cheap chain from the arcade. A free rental voucher from the costume shop. A watering can full of extremely strong smelling fertilizer okay well, strong smelling fertilizer should have been close so it doesn't seem uh, do you guys see anything to do in here or do we have to come back at no. some point no it seems like back. the bump of john is the only interactive element over here we can't go through here either so i guess this yeah. is all an advertisement all... for a whack me contest a whack me contest. Oh, no. wait, look at those colors. Those colors remind me of that phone. Jeez. Blue, uh, purple. I gotta write this down. Blue, purple, red. 
orange, yellow, green, orange. Let me take a photo. You have won Whack Me's Not Everyone's a Winner contest. If you call our hotline and give all the right answers to our nearly impossible questions, we'll say you have. So we have to call the hotline. Uh, you have won a free Whack Me product is yours today in the unlikely event that you answer all of our questions correctly. That's right. There are absolutely no strings attached except you have to answer every last one of our maniacally difficult questions mm. frankly we doubt that today is your lucky day call now for your free prize okay this will be fun how do we call where do we, now we got to figure out let's how to go call. to the bar let's go, let's go all to the, the way bar. back to the bar really yeah that's where we had uh, our phone see this feels like i'm exhausted we're gonna have to get back on the thing we're gonna we have to get the elephant to take well, us we across go, we, we can go back to the there's a third uh roadway we can go down yeah I think you yeah. were... Oh. Wow, you almost died. Whack me outlet. Play with the levers. At the bottom. Yep. What am I trying to do? Don't know. Maybe at a certain hour, something is supposed to happen. Well, how many times does it go? So if I do, it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. Try it again. Does it go all the way? It goes 11. It goes all the way up to 11. It goes all the way around. <laughs> Can you enter the building? Yeah, but I, uh, I just don't. We're learning a lot of. Whoa! You know, I guess we can't. Fall gift o -matic. Those what things in the case on? are concept models of the latest Whack Me designs. A boxing glove. A box of exploding cigars. I love it's the stereotypical powder. Ren and Stimpy music. Mm hmm. This is the. Oh, no. We're sorry, we're experiencing technical difficulties. Yeah. yeah. What is going on here? Can I talk to him? Yeah, I can. Hi there, guys. He's Warp. I'm Wood. Welcome to Whack Me. Great, 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 some ice. Oh, Whack Me is just kind of a natural extension of Warp and Me's hobby, see? What hobby is that? Beating the living crap out of each other for grins. <laughs> One day we realized, hey, here we are beating the living crap out of each other. But what's in it for us? And then Warp said, you know, Woof, wouldn't all self-respecting zanies just give their eye teeth for the opportunity to beat the living crap out of each other with the same style and finesse as us? Well, actually, Warp just kind of chuckled this weird chuckle, but I knew what he meant. And so, Whack Me was born. Abuse tools by the experts. Exactly. We can put our names on Whack Me products with confidence because we've tested every item personally over and over <laughs> on each other. Oh boy, I'm not sure I want to keep breaking this ice. Ain't you idiot? Hey, we saw a market niche and we <laughs> filled it. And Zany do turn around and you step on someone who needs an anvil. It's been a while since I was in here. Anything new? <laughs> Anything new? You hear that, Warp? <laughs> Anything new? Are you kidding, mister? You turn around, we got something new every day. Well, I thought it was... Turn around, you step on somebody who needs an anvil. Don't get smart, son. Stay the way you are. So, what is new? Our latest <laughs> prototypes are in the case there. Uh, they aren't for sale just yet. 
we have to get them more somehow. Than happy to demonstrate them for you. Oh yeah, sounds good. Let's try like a cigar. Wow. Could you demonstrate one of those cigars? Absolutely. But <coughs> be warned, this is no mere exploding cigar. This is the fat man of trick stogies. Smoking this sucker is real bad for your health. Best of all, it's guaranteed to go off in your mouth, not in your hands. Check it out. Nice. All right, so I'll take two. All right, let's try the boxing. Well, let's try this thing. The exploding What's something. What's that machine in the corner? That little beauty is the one and only free fall gift o -matic. Just push the button to start it, then stop it at the gift you want by pushing the button again. It's our little way of saying a big thank you to our oh, valued paying customers. <laughs> oh, how do we pay? Let's try the boxing. We'd love to see a demonstration of that boxing glove. Right away, customer satisfaction is our middle name. Let me guess. Turn around, you step on another satisfied customer. Correct. Now listen up. With the simple press of a button, this glove will smash the living daylights out of any unsuspecting sucker skull. The chump on the receiving end is guaranteed to see stars every time. Crush all you want, folks. This glove is built to outlast your victim's heads blow after blow after beautiful blow. Observe. Note the quality of our genuine synthetic leather. Oh Jeez! My oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> He's not there Grab the anymore. Stars. Grab the stars. Oh, I don't think he can. All right. Well, what happened there? This is as kid-friendly as it gets. <laughs> Hi guys, how's business? Painful. Uh, Punch his brains Glad out. to hear it. Do we want to do all the rest of them, or we want to go try to get them from the giftomatic? Do we want to see that guy get his? Can we take yeah, a might as well see all the, all the violence they animated. Variety, squirt and flower. Why sprinkle your buddy with plain old water when you can douse him with an unhealthy portion of extra strength acid? <laughs> oh, this will be fun. Observe. Show him more. <laughs> oh, good. Now it's his turn. Oh my God. <laughs> Very Ren and Stimpy, huh? Yeah. They're very uh, uh, itchy and scratchy. This is gonna melt off. Oh. This is good stuff. Let's find out about the that shaker. powder looks interesting. That's our patented shake and flake itching powder. Sure, lots of stuff can make you itch, but our powder has a special added ingredient, leprosy. I guarantee it'll give you a lot more than a little tangle. Leprosy. <laughs> Ready, War? Leprosy. <laughs> Is he gonna get himself or his partner? Oh boy. Uh. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Which one do we want, you guys? This is all, all of them. Stuff. We have to get all of them? All right, let's go on over here. Let's say goodbye. Well, guys, I'm afraid we have to get going. I always hate to see our friends leave, especially when they haven't bought anything. Come again soon. Let's get a gift. Mind if I use your gift machine? I certainly do, friend. That machine is for our paying customers. But I am a paying customer. Don't you remember? Just the other day? When I bought all that stuff? No, but I'll tell you what, son. Just show me that whack me stuff you're talking about, and I'll be happy to let you use our fine machine. Okay, so now we got a new goal. We don't have anything here. That check in the box is whack me. Branded. A royal music box, complete with an embossed portrait of King Hugh nope. on the lid. No. no, we don't have anything. Okay, just all these rooms where we're going to have to come back to. Yep. And you have to keep track of all the puzzles we need to solve. And then this is another thing we don't know what to do. Eventually we'll have to figure out. Some Somebody's going to tell us, oh, if 
if only at 12 o'clock we could do this thing. So we've gone down all these places. We have nothing that we can well, do the, here. The only puzzle we can solve at the moment, or only progress we can oh, wow, have at the moment, is by calling that number at the bar. Yes. Well, let's do it. Well, what did happen? Oops, I somehow double clicked on the zoom. And... What is going on? Oh boy. Okay, well, all right. My. All right, let's go this way. Now we're going to go by her. We're going to go this way, yeah. I wish there was a skip ahead, kind of, just goes. Yeah, the double click doesn't work. Um, I forgot where the phone was. Which one room and was the it the bar. At? Is this On the, the bar? left. No. That's the bar. Oh, yeah, yeah. The bar is the bar. Speed it up there. Okay, there's the phone. Yep. Okay, so let's see. I took a photo. Okay, it's blue. Yeah. Then purple. 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 So yeah. red and blue. And blue. No, yeah. I think you got to be faster than that. So blue, blue, red, blue. Yeah, you got to be faster. Okay. So, you want uh, me to do this? Up. Let me hang see up what I phone. can. Uh oh, how do you hang up? Use the hook. So blue, red, blue. Blue. No. No, you gotta, you gotta let the blue sink in. Okay. You want me to do that? Oh, okay. Now I. No, no, no. I think I can see it now. Okay. Sorry. So. So, blue, so first purple. one's blue, right? Yeah. The first one's just blue, correct? Yep. Yes. Yep. Okay. Now so purple. Awesome. Now red. Yeah, just red. Now orange. Now red and yellow. Awesome. Now yellow. Now green. So blue and yellow. Now orange. All right. That was fun. Welcome to Wacme's Not Everyone's a Winner Contest. It's easy to play. Just listen to each question, and then, using your touch hue phone, dial in the answer. Ready? Question one. What color is Jim's fur? Well, we have to remember what he looks like. Do we, can we get a Jim picture is, uh, of that? Jim, if, Jim if is the bulldog. The He's yeah. blue. You can remember all this, you guys, or we have to get a picture of it. Question: What color are the fishtails on top of the outhouse? Jeez. On top okay. of the outhouse, uh, yellow. Really? Yeah. You're remembering this? Question three: Besides white, what color is Warp's fur? Which one's Warp? Warp. Uh, that one I don't know. Um, Should we write down the questions? Okay, let's. Fur. Yeah, let's write down the questions. Which one is warp? Which... The time limit. Oh, three. Besides white, what color is warp's fur? Warp's Try fur. Try orange. Question four. You what got that right? I don't know if that was right or not. Right shoulder of a toilet sentry's uniform. What on the place? right shoulder. Okay. Um. Uh. Uh. uh one was it red. Was, one was it yellow. was red and yellow. So either red or maybe yellow. On the right shoulder. Okay. Red. You just said yellow. Question five. What color is Wolf's collar? Goodness gracious. Uh, how about green? 
Just cause. And our final question is, on the zany do sign, what color is the arrow oh, I don't to know. Jim's gym? Let's do purple. We're going to get a lot wrong here. Sorry, you did not answer all of our questions correctly. But please call again soon. Okay, all right, so, so we got to get a picture we need of... To, uh, who's Warp? Huh? Warp. Who's Warp? Yeah, let's look this up. Let's, let's get a picture of... What's, a, what's the room called? So we, we need to, to look up Warp's for fur... Uh, what, on the, the guard's right shoulder to see what color the fish yeah. is, and Zane yeah. you sign yeah, pointing is. to Jim's. Uh, Warp okay. is the cat. Warp is the cat from Whack Me, the, the 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 one that laughs all the time. No, so he's orange. Okay, so um, the the red, the right shoulder is red, and the left shoulder is yellow. Right is red, left is yellow. Um, I'm looking at the picture of the inside of the room now, and, uh, what was the question about, what, besides white, what color, who, who are we looking at besides Warps white? Warp's fur. Who's Warp, warp again? Warp's fur is orange. Warp is the big cat that laughs all the time. So Warp, oh right, is orange, okay. What about, um, the collar, Wolf's collar? That I don't know. Which one's Wolf? Is that Jim? Which one? Who's Wolf? Wolf is the is the dog, the purple dog. So purple. So purple. <laughs> Wait, the purple dog where? The purple dog that was in at the, the Wackney uh, factory. The, the oh, the one, right. the oh. one that talked like this. Okay, for yeah. paying customers. Gotcha. Wackney. Factory. Just trying to look at pictures of it. Oh, okay. Oh, um, green. This collar is green. Gotcha. I feel like we're kind of cheating, but not really. Um, fish on left shoulder, wolf's collar, arrow pointing to Jim's gym. Oh, boy. Someone said it's blue in the chat. It is. He's right. It's blue. Okay. All these people in the chat aren't lying. They don't lie. They're on our side. And look, what else? Do we get anything else? Um, the gym floor. And Jim's fur. What's Jim's fur? He's blue, right? Jim yeah, floor. Yeah, Jim's fur is blue. And it's also blue, or is it purple? I guess it's bluish purple, maybe. All right, it might be purple. Gym floor. No, I Jim, can't tell. Jim's, Jim's fur is blue. I'm sure. Yeah, but what is the gym floor? Jim's no. I'm Jim, uh, sorry. Oh, uh, the gym floor. Um, uh, that I it. don't remember. I would say red, but I don't remember. Well, it's either blue or purple. I, I'm looking at a picture of it. I can't tell. Oh, you know what? Yeah. No, you know what? He's a little bit. Jim is kind of greenish. Let's go to the what? gym. You want to go back to the gym? All right. Yeah. In real okay. life. All right. All right. How do we go? Jim was not one? the the dog was not green. It was blue. Well, let's. All right. Let's go. Come on. I wish we could just skip ahead. This is very. At least in Monkey Island, he walked. They walked fast. Depending on which Monkey Island. That's true. Call a friend, says Shadow Rage. We are your permanent ask the audience. That's so true. All right, we're going to figure you out. We'll get you, we're going to get you something to calm you down. All right, let's go back over here. It's That's a lot of work to get back. Ridiculous contraption I've ever seen. Of course it is. It's the Zany Do Shuttle. Oh boy. Adding time to the game. Mm -hmm. Alright, so let's go over here. On the right is the way to whack me. Say what? So the sign to the gym is blue, like we see over here. Yeah, the arrow is blue. 
Oh. Do we need what do we need to know about these guys? Nothing. We we got it. Okay. Go so to the go gym. I thought I was going to the gym. The gym's over here, right? Okay, there we go. Jim's gym. Okay, so the sign. On his right I shoulder, it's red. I knew the red. fish on top of the outhouse were yellow. <laughs> right? The right shoulder is red. Mm hmm. It's red. Left is yellow. Uh, and was there anything else we needed to know here before? Go, the, go inside the gym. Sorry. Okay, so, so he's that, blue. He's blue. So what's this? That's four. Is that purple? It's also blue. Different kinds of blue. All right. Well, what's his name? Jim. He's blue. Okay. So Jim is uh, what blue. else do we the need to is blue. The floor is blue. Whose color did we need to find? We did it already. It's uh, okay. blue. Right, okay, so do we have all of the answers? Work Let's see. Do we? Grand? We have Jim's fur. It's blue. The gym floor. Warps oh, you know what? Fur. The gym Warp. floor. Uh, fish on the right shoulder. Fish on the left shoulder. Wolf's collar. Arrow pointing to Jim's. But we should probably look at the arrow pointing to Lackney too. Brucey Kibbutz. So, which, okay, that's that's blue and that's red. So, Lackney arrow. All right, I think we have everything. Do we? Can we go back? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Bet you anything the questions change, though. No, 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 they have to be the same questions. Otherwise, we'll rage quit the game. Yeah, I think there might be more questions. It just depends on which ones you get. I mean, if this there is a permanent set of questions, then I get it. They send you to find various things around the... around Zanidu, but... Otherwise, if they change the questions, it's going to be super yes. frustrating Falcon because... Falcon says we should go to Whack Me first, but I mean, we may have missed something at Whack Me. <laughs> okay, yeah. let's go come back. Do we ever go into, into that room? What's, what's yeah. the oh, that's the costume shop. Okay, here we go. Oh, you Do you guys mind if I make long-distance calls on your phone? Okay, what was it again? It was blue. Okay, it's blue. Purple. Red. Red. Orange. Yellow. No, yellow. Oops. Yeah, yellow. I did I did green. He did green. You gotta okay. hang up try again. Blue. Purple. Purple. Yeah. Red. Red. Orange. Orange. And then yellow. Yellow. Green. And orange. Do, 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 Wolf's purple. I agree. I think Wolf. Everyone's a winner yes. contest. It's easy to play. Just listen to each question, and then, using your touch hue phone, dial in the answer. Ready? Question one. Yes. What color are the floor tiles inside Jim's gym? Blue. The tiles. Blue. Blue. Question two. What color are the Rocky Mountains of... Oh, oh man. Let's rage Rocky quit. Mountains. I'm looking at a walkthrough now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Give us yeah, the answers. 
Okay, you Mine's know what? orange. I... Oh, hell. Question right, three. Up. Besides white, what color is Wolf's fur? Orange. I'll try this again later. No, I'll do it now. Okay. Blue. Purple. Yeah. Red. Hello? Red. Orange. Orange. Yellow. Yellow. Yeah. Green. 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 And orange, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this is ridiculous. Yeah, Come on, we can do it. I'm on a, I'm a, I'm a walkthrough now. Come on. Not everyone's a winner contest. It's easy to play. Just listen to each question and then using oh, your we're ready for you now. Let's see what we can let's see if we can the answer. No, let's not. Question one. <laughs> what color are the floor tiles? Okay, we know what that that's blue. blue. Question two. What color are the Rocky Mountains of the way orange. out back? They're orange. <laughs> Question three. Besides white, what color is Wolf's fur? Purple. Orange. Uh, purple? Okay. Purple. Question four. What color fish can be found on the left shoulder of a toilet sentry's uniform? On the left shoulder. Yellow. Is it yellow? Uh, yeah. yeah. I looked at my notes that time. That wasn't even a cheat. That was Question me. Five. What color are the plant pots outside? Oh my gosh. Me? Purple. Oh, for gosh sakes. Awesome. Pots. And our final question is on the Zany Do sign, what color is the arrow pointing to whack me? Red. 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 Click. Yeah. So, boy, oh boy. This must have been. Such a nightmare for those who played this yeah. originally. Your fabulous whack me prize should be arriving right now. Nice. Awesome. Save. Wait, no, go get the prize and then save. <laughs> Where's the prize? Probably Wait, outside. Let's save. Whack me. Guess we're gonna go out. Okay, pick up uh, the Amazon package over there. <laughs> what me jumping beans? What? We got it's a whack me jumping beans. So it means remember we have to give. Yeah, I got it. But uh, what would we use it for? We're gonna give it to the guy. To show him that we have uh, something from at Whack Me, right? Uh, that's right. So I think we have to go back right. there now, right? Yeah. Boy, this is just so much travel. We have to go way over there. This guy's getting his steps in, that's for sure. Mm hmm. Uh oh, no, let's go this way. Yeah, Zen Solpsa says, imagine writing down every question on paper because your parents can't afford dial-up. Oh, the old days. Back in our day when the internet was dial-up. Okay, uh, whack me. We're going to whack me. That path on the right, right is the way oh, okay. to whack all right, all right. me. Say what? All right. Miss and me. And at the same time, Again. Phantasmagora 2 came out and had a link to the Phantasmagora 2 website in which Lorelai Shannon had an interview. And there were behind the scenes photos of yeah. you guys. Yeah. This is a video? No, the the Fantasy Glory 2 website from back oh. in the day. Oh, we're gonna. Yeah. Come on, man. 
I can give it to you? I believe these whack me jumping beans prove that I'm a paying customer. Why, yes, they do. Help yourself Boy, to the That was a lot of work. She's Get some beans. Alright, here we go. Oh, I guess I Place them in your inventory. Let's play the game. Congratulations, champ. Let's give this guy a hand. Or at least a glove. Okay, we got a glove. Can we play it again? Oh, yeah. Okay, so... The we magnet. Got... We gotta search the haystack with the magnet. No cigar this time, friend. But we do have a consolation prize. Hope this makes you feel better. <laughs> wow. Looks like he just knocked his head out. Okay, here we go. Does it go up and down? I don't think so. I got that. You, my friend, are the lucky winner of a whack me ulti mallet. Pound for pound, the best quality bludgeoning device. How do they make any profit given the fact that she can use the gift of Maddox as many times as you want? Uh, how wow. How are we going to get the. Uh... Will it just go up and down? Let's see if it just goes up and down. Yeah, because there are only four options. Uh, I believe we've already awarded that prize, but good news, we have a substitute. He's going to smack us in the head again. All right, I'm going to let it go up and then work its way down. That's what I'm going to try to do. Oh, you have to stop it right away. I don't want to be greedy. No prize is necessary, really. I'm afraid I just don't have the heart to deprive you of this. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, you might have to do this. I'll try it one more time. Okay, let me do this. Yeah, you so we, we need the magnet, right? Yeah. There you go. We have a winner. You'll be taking home our top prize. The Whack Me Mega Magnet with our patented no-slip grip. Easy on off switch and more pull than your local elected official. All right, so we got all the stuff we need right now. So now... But this is a business, not a charity. Okay, so we can no longer use... Okay, we got everything. Okay, let's get... Let's skadoodle. Hey, can I Can I try? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Isn't that funny? It's like, can I, can I drive for a little while? Yeah. Can I steer? There's something I want to try. I'm dying to try this because. Well, at first, in order to get into the the outlet, we had to try it three to different you times. You guys are regular regulars. <laughs> something I gotta know. Would you mind demonstrating that glove again? Say no more. Oh, Customer picking up the stars. Number one priority. Yeah. I thought it was your middle name. Listen to this. Yeah. With the simple press of a button, this glove will smash the living daylights out of any unsuspecting sucker skull. The chump on the receiving end is guaranteed to see stars every time. And he mentions the stars. No the quality of our genuine synthetic leather. <laughs> Get ready. Oh, nice sure job. I know where these came from. I got them. Nice work. Well done. You are a true observant gamer. In the bag. That's fun. Oh, I get it. The door with the light on. Oh. It's the one that you have to walk through. Oh. Interesting. Okay, hey, what about okay. the clock? We haven't figured that out yet. Are you going to give something a go here? I have no idea about the clock. Um, the only thing I can think of is to set it to noon. 
Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. But I don't know if there's a. How are you doing? How are you able to do it one by one? I just, just it once. Yeah, you just click it. Ooh, that's weird. Okay, so... Mm -mm. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> brute forced it. You brute forced it. That was a wonderful. But why done six? There. Why six? That yeah. mechanical bird is an even worse shape than the clock. And you tried to get to noon, and I was trying to get to noon. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's All funny. right. I won't argue with success. And there's, yeah. but there, we didn't get anything out of it. We, we can't take the bird. Maybe we need to give the some bird point? something. Give the bird the fish. Give the no, bird wait, the red hair. Wait, we saw we th we saw the guard do something. He left. Let oh, okay, so so now we can go to the restroom. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Oh, maybe because it's six p.m. Then he went home. Censored oh, that's fish it. I bet we can give our red herring to that that bird. Toilet paper with a message. Bus for victory. Deposit, Deposit fish, in bowl. fish in bowl. Okay, that's red Everybody herring. Stand by for excitement. Toggle fish launcher to initiate flush sequence. Focus on the fish. Reactivate fish launcher to reverse flush fish. Gauge worthiness of catch. Official what? fish ranking, loser go home. Yeah, whatever. A medium rarity, not bad. The mother of all fish flushes, you win. Flush at your own risk. Government of Xanadu and Bureau of Recreational Plumbing not responsible for injury damage or odd fishy odor. Take the fish. Looks like the toilet is clogged. Can't fish flush with a clogged toilet. No way, no how. How do we unclog the Think toilet, you know, my, guys? I took a quick whiz. Mind? This is a sophisticated piece of sporting equipment. Next, you'll be wanting to besmirch the scroll of wisdom. Uh, okay, unclogging the toilet. Please. Um, Just break the toilet. Wait, we can use the hammer at the arcade, right? I can't unclog the toilet with this. The fishes are dancing. Yeah. Uh, there's a. There's, you can use the glove. The the glove. I can try that. I'll do that next. That won't unblock the toilet. He sometimes <laughs> says unclog and sometimes Maybe I unblock. Reach down there and see what I can find. I mean, uh, what's the worst thing that could be clogging a toilet? Never mind. Uh, Maybe I should reach down there and see what I can find. I mean, what's the worst thing that could be clogged? Never mind. What? So he's not going to do it? He's not going to do it. It sounded um, like he will do it. Yeah, you weren't. You weren't able to. Once he says that, you weren't able to. To. Activate he it? didn't do it. He didn't do it. Huh. Other than plungers. Let's get Christopher Lloyd on the show. If you could uh, if you could pull that off, that'd be great. Yeah. Uh you know, of he all was... the things you could ask him about Toonstruck though. Yeah. Nothing about, you know, the Adams family or or Back to the Future. I'll just talk to him about Toonstruck and the new King's Quest. That's it. Did you guys ever see the movie One Flew or the Cuckoo's Nest? Yeah. Yep. I think it was one of his very first movies. Him and Danny DeVito played uh, 
the mental patients in the in the that movie. No, we'll there's get so many, Christopher Lloyd and let him play the game himself. There's so many puzzles up in the air in this game. Yeah. That would be so great just to get a hold of him and to get him to play his own game or just to have, you know. Aha, like they always say, there's more than one way to search a haystack. Is we should reach out, Daniel, for? just for the heck of it, you know? Why not? Okay. You sweet, dear thing! You found the Churnatron's missing part! Oh, you And then, once we get Christopher oh, Lloyd, then we can I'm get so Robert excited. Patrick as well. I've got butterflies in my yeah. stomachs! And ask him about the dig. Nothing about what Terminator 2, exactly. just the dig. We'll play the dig with him. Excuse we'll just play with me, him. Gentlemen. We'll try to track these guys down and have them play their own game together. Oh, dear God, this is gonna be... Oh, so disturbing. We got some butter. Oh. This is so upsetting. Oof. Butter! Oh, I don't know how to thank you! Oh, or actually, At this point, I had already forgotten about this, this first area steps. and what we were doing. One for each of you. Thanks. We, uh, can't wait to taste it. What is with this horse? Um... Oh. oh, stop it. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. This we was fun. I'm glad we're here. Maybe oh, we can open an OnlyFans for this scene. I gotta get out. Ugh. Gary Ankylis says Mark Hamill and The Dig. Well, Mark Hamill wasn't in The Dig. Mark Hamill and Full Throttle, maybe. Yeah, Mark or Hamill Mar for Full Throttle, yeah. Or Mark yeah, Hamill really for Gabriel Knight 1. Like also. hand wrote, well, butter than nothing. <laughs> All right, now what are we doing? Arcade, okay. Ooh, I know. We used the hammer on the thing. It's Chwex tip ten dollars. Toonstruck is the best game that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Mind if I take a whack at that strength? Thank you, Sure, go ahead. <laughs> he is your lucky mallet. No thanks. I brought my own. Hey, 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 nobody said nothing about bringing your own freaking mallet. Besides, that clunky thing isn't gonna get you anywhere. Like my old pop used to say to me, fingers, you stupid, good-for-nothing little people. <laughs> Always use the right tool for the job. And by the way, you smell like crap. Wise guy, my pop. I'll bet. Now I suggest you put that down before I... Uh, uh, uh. Remember, this is Cutopia. Before you hurt your poor little back. Oh, but if you want to use it, just go right ahead. Huh? Wow. An FMV scene with Christopher Lloyd. <laughs> oh, dear. Looks like we've had a little accident. Now put that thing away before you hurt yourself. Or I hurt myself. <laughs> he couldn't even muster a good laugh. Okay, Don so that didn't work. Louise. Well, why? Why didn't that work? We're not strong enough. We gotta get pumped up. <laughs> so we have to go to the gym and get pumped. Get jacked, get ripped. Oh, that's probably get it, shredded. Right? Do 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 do. So someone wrote in the chat that maybe they used royalty-free music for this game because they spent all of their budget on Christopher Lloyd.
In the meantime, I see a chat message. Spoonie says Lego Toadetto. Do you remember the Game Heroes? Yes, I remember did the Game you? Heroes. Uh, I used to did... used to do some projects with them. Yeah. Okay, I guess they. Did you see that Tom and Nikki have started streaming on Twitch? Yes, I've seen them. Uh, I've seen, I follow their Twitter, so I've seen them stream. Okay, I want to get pumped up. Fast yeah, but, but, but we don't have a membership. We have more things. Stop right there, worm-like insect. That machine is only for club members. You are barely fit to look at it, let alone touch its shiny chrome. Why is you? Okay, so how, how do we become club members? I'm back! Welcome, skinny sad man. Come worship at the altar of my rippling muscles. Hmm. Let me guess. You're... Jim. And we never talked to him before? Ooh. I am becoming yes, flabbergasted. To my surprising, your little monkey head actually contains a tiny brain. Actually, my species parted ways with the monkeys a long time ago. Then we started to use tools, grow vegetables, and domesticate lesser mammals. So Human Convertible Such says you have what you need to get pumped ha -ha. here. While the monkey man grows vegetables, I am growing muscles. I don't think he has any idea what I was talking about. Yeah, well, that makes three of us. And so, what's so great about this gym, anyway? What is being so great about this gym was asking the pretty little lady man. My techniques have helped hundreds become stronger, less pathetic individuals. Of course, no pupil has ever come close to equaling my strength. Of course. What? But all of my customers are walking out that door able to kick the flabby hindquarters of weaklings like you. Take a certain sailor man. I put him on an all spinach diet. You should see him now. Actually, I think I have. Oh, that's Popeye. That You're talking about Popeye, you guys. You are looking at the ultimate piece of bodybuilding equipment, the Pumpotron. Guaranteed to be beating even the most pathetic loser into a powerful specimen of manhood. Hey, Drew, listen to that. Sounds like there's hope for you after all. Sorry, Charlie. The equipment is only for club members. Great. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and join up. Wrong again, Peewee man. Membership is by invitation only. My invitation. And, uh... We're not invited. Bingo, puny wimp rant. What's all the gymnastics stuff for? That is my personal equipment. I use it to demonstrate my agility and grace. If you ask me, all those bars and things look kind of dangerous. To a clumsy, bumbling monkey like you, yes. But for me, my routine is as easy as one, two. Say, Jim, could you possibly do us a small favor? What is it that you are wanting? Speak, stick figure, man. Well, I, I was just wondering if maybe Flux and I could see your routine. All right, I suppose I can be giving you a quick demonstration. Oh boy, I can hardly be waiting. Gotta work on your legs a little bit. Well, wow, that was amazing. You could be famous. I mean, what? any circus would kill for a dog act like that. I'm not the dog. Well, it's time for us to go. Hey, we must have been here several months in dog years. Do not be getting attitude, smarty slacks, or I will be having no choice but to pound you into a puddle with teeth. Okay, now what? So Even apparently we have what we need to progress here. To get can jacked. We go to, like, Maybe we, we need uh, the magnet. No, 
we used the magnet already. The gloves. The gloves are like boxing gloves. Maybe the stars. Food. Okay, so the, the only... The only things you can interact with in the scene are the Pumptron and the equipment in the back over there. Can we interact with a cat? No, not no. a cat. What about like the barbells, like the bones over there, the little rack of bones? Anything no. There? no. So we need to do something with the equipment. Oh, try that. the vaulting horse as well. Maybe Flux can do something with that. That oh, is my yeah, personal he's... equipment. Do not be making me hurt you. Okay, so anyway, use flux on, I don't know, the horse and the no, equipment. No, no, not like that. No. Oh. No, I should look it up. Maybe if I show him the hammer. I need to be able to lift this. I can teach you how to be lifting that I have a feeling he's not the one who would get pounded. No. You know, I love the fact that they have custom responses and not just I can't use these things together. Butter? Butter on the horse. Only see me do that. Almost everything is better with butter. Okay, really? now can. Yeah. What? Wait, what was that? How do you pathetic pipsqueak run? Hello, young Jim. Oh, I'll ask him buddy. to show you. Do not his be routine. mistaking me. I am not some kind of aging friend of yours in any way. Boy, that routine of yours sure looked dangerous. I mean, if it were me, I'd be afraid I'd break my neck. But then you don't have one, so I guess you don't have to worry. There is no danger to me. I'm keeping my equipment in perfect condition, much like my body. In that case, if it's no trouble, I sure would like to see your routine again. All right, I will be performing for you to be showing you what you can never hope to achieve. As long as nobody has put butter on my vaulting horse. So soon? Come again when you can't stay longer! I think we, we killed see. him! Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we should see we'll if he's play. okay. Oh my gosh. Alright, now we're huge. <laughs> so how does it feel to be in tippy -top Look at his fidgeters. Do you have any aspirin? So much better than mine. I, I give. I give. I. So now I'm bulked okay. up. Huh? I concede yeah. to the ma to the master. Let's just check. Uh, let's check Jim out. Oh. Wow. Oh, With the cows and all. So now that the the cows are unhinged. Should we go check on the cows? Let's let's check on the cows. Yeah. Huh. We're back. Well, if it isn't the dynamic duo. Nice to see you boys again. No time to chat. We were just taking a quick break. <laughs> oh, I understand. Sometimes you just have to stop and smell the sweet corn. Oh no. This is gonna be sad. They're gonna be all evil inside, that's sad. 
Marge! Polly? Jesus. Oh dear God! Marge and Punisher Polly! Divas of Destruction! Oh my God! Do you still think it's a kid-friendly game, Paul? Oh, <laughs> ladies? Ladies? No. Well, not technically speaking, of course. Give it to me! Mince my meat! Oh, boy. That's it, demonetized. Hey, we both have a uh, belly button rings. The fire has hit the barn. It's Phantasm Gore 2 reenacted by cows. And I've never felt better. Harder! Harder! Tenderize this side of beef! Bad no. cow! Yikes. Bad I need an adult, cow. says Molio. <laughs> Fox, we can't just stand here! You're absolutely right. Black whipping boy wildly, reporting for duty. Oh my gosh. What is getting spit out by the machine? Say, oh, I think the... Uh, yeah, it's maybe unhinged like butter. Move. Elmer? That's a sticky question. Very sticky. Oh, I Elmer's turned into glue. I Elmer for quite a while, but he's certainly around here somewhere. He's up there dripping. <laughs> oh, he's glue. Did you get the feeling they're not telling us something? That's okay. Yep. If it's what I think it is, we didn't want to know anyway. <sighs> What's wrong with your Trinitron? Call me crazy, but I, I swear it's making glue. Of course it is! Can't you read? It's a gluatron! With it, I'm making the finest glue in the world! The quickest drying! The strongest smelling! I know you want it! But you can't have any! That ridiculous whip! There's got to be something better! Whip well, we my gotta find cream! Something than the lip. Whip my cream! <laughs> hey, what can you we have that's better than the whip? My hide's getting numb. This just <laughs> this is so healthy. Funny. Yeah, I know. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry I followed quiet. I had I just, just have no words. Right. <laughs> uh, begging your forgiveness, mistress, but I can't whip any harder. Then use something else, you worthless insect. G but give I've her the glove. Tried everything in the barn. You got anything we can use? Pliers, staple gun, flamethrower. I think I might have some toenail clippers. Forget it. We well, got something. See you later. It's been disturbing. Wow. Careful with that whip. You could hurt somebody. <laughs> First of all, pick up the glue. Then the give her the they glue. They said I can't have any. Oh. The okay. mallet. The mallet? Mince my meat. Mince my meat. <laughs> Pathetic worm. We've tried that before. I'm numb to that kind of abuse. I need Jeez. a new, unbearably delectable form of torture. Whip my cream. <sighs> Whip my cream. Don't spare the rod. Huh. More glue is you got something some. you earn. Did you get some? Slug. No. What have no. you done for us lately? Okay, give, give them. Me. How about give the mallet? <laughs> Give her her own butter back. Pathetic worm! We tried that before. Try the I'm butter. To that kind of I don't think I have any butter left. Butter. Yeah, you have a you have a bus stick of butter. How is butter a form of abuse? Well, it might remind her that she used to churn butter and. Yeah, butter. Ozzy Astaroth tipped five dollars. If we don't reach the goal today. We spin the wheel o love instead of the wheel o Curtis. Please donate. <laughs> Lol. Thank hey, thank you, Ozzy, and thanks uh you 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 mighty few who have donated today. We appreciate it. And anybody who can join, we'd sure appreciate that too. Okay, I don't think there's anything I can do here. Don't spare the rod! Maybe the acid? <laughs> What's up with the acid, yeah? There's so. no way I'm putting my hand in there. Don't yeah, use the glove. Now we already used Give that for... <laughs> No. 
about the um Don't how about the, the uh the water, I, wonder, water. I wonder what the, the voice Plant actors thing. thought of this scene. I know exactly. I was thinking the same thing. Who needs fertilizer? I'd rather have this stuff. There you go. Awesome. So give that to it's her. Like now? Meat. <laughs> What does it say? A watering can full of dangerous looking stuff. I'll give that to Don't her? Spare the rod! No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Don't you want to try the dangerous looking stuff on them? No, they, they won't want it, I don't think. Because it might cause more pain than the whip. Okay. You just want to get out of this room, and I don't blame you. I do, I really do. We tried that before. All right. Uh. More, you sack of mutton. Sack of mutton. Thanks for mutton. <laughs> and Joseph says, "Meanwhile, wholesome Carecrow just being cute outside." They had nothing to the bunny, just walking past. She's like, I know, oh. exactly. Mind if I take a whack at that strengthometer? Sure, go ahead. It's Twix tip 10 melon. pieces weight. No, Maybe use I the corn. Cornography. <laughs> <laughs> Um, thank you, Schwex, and we really appreciate you. You are consistent and generous support. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, uh, uh. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Congratulations! <laughs> you don't think I'm impressed. You know what they say about guys who need big melons. Okay, Squid Boy, where's our chef, please? Squid Boy! Yeah, 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 here. Another Thank you, you reference. Hey, this isn't Chablis. This says it's Captain Blowhard's crew wine. Yeah. yeah, and I hope you both joke on it. It is Dom DeLuise, exactly. Right now, I can go. So now that we got wine, we can, uh, yeah. <laughs> what can we do? <laughs> What's that yellow door straight ahead? Who, who knows? There are so many pending puzzles. Bakery? What? No, oh, these All guys. Right. Yanis tipped $10. Hey. Thank you, Yanis. Yeah, I appreciate it. You need butter to make bread. Yeah, so you didn't even tell us, so you didn't even give us a thing. <sighs> Thank yeah. you. Anyways, appreciate it. Thank you. What are we You're thanking welcome. him for? You're welcome. <clears throat> Welcome, butter. Aw, oh, thank you, friends. Now, allow me to treat you to the yummy wares of my day young bakery. Joy. Joy. Yeah, happy. Oh, joy. Nice right, so work, Dad. Glad we remembered this place. There you go. One freshly prepared lump of raw dough, yeah. Yummy. Yeah, definitely, ah, definitely, yeah. Just one. It felt wonderful making dough again. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm so happy. Me too. Completely, perfectly happy. Fabulously, amazingly, wonderfully happy. <laughs> if only Ray were here to celebrate with us. <laughs> Boy, Aww. that didn't last long. 
<laughs> um, human convertible made a good point. We have not checked out the spooky part of the woods yet. Yeah. But we got we're getting some stuff here. This is good. Booga booga land. Perfect. And then we go back in that other hole. room, the, the white door. Yeah, hang on. We're, Oh. Do we want to fix the pothole? Maybe magnet? Uh, I don't think we have anything to fix the pothole yet. And she's like all happy for a second and then we walk right by her. And she's like, oh. I think the only reason why Christopher Lloyd agreed to be part of this game, or the way they explained it to him, was it's just like Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Right. And since he he starred in Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Oh, the path. Oh. <coughs> Would he showed up if we had doing, tried to... Hello. Lovely day for a stroll, ain't it? BB Wolf at your service. BB. Short for Big Bad. Catchy. And practical. Big Bad is a real mouthful. Another you think he would have been activated friend. if and we tried to go into the um, dark forest earlier? Did we need to do all the other stuff first? Again. Probably. Black and he's flux wildly. Please do eat meat. You. Ah, uh, that's nice. Anyway, we'd better be going. Stick around, the memento, fellas. I got a little flavor to ask you. See, I'm having some friends for dinner this evening, and I was hoping you might bring me a bottle of tasteful vino. Boom, we got the vino. Um, raccoon tips three dollars. Still glass. reeling over the whipped cream I segment. Testies, if you snatch <laughs> your Hey, that I can feel creepy. a little testes myself when the mood takes me. Consider Thank your you. drift firmly stanched, Mr. Wolf. Please call me BB. I persist. All right, BB. We'll be sure to keep an eye out for some wine. Uh, pardon me, friends, but I do believe there's been a small incommunicado. See, I'm not asking you to keep an eye out. I'm telling you to bring me some stinking wine if you want to get through these woods alive. Hey! Okay, good. Now I want to wish you and your friend good luck in your missionary. That's real big of you, BB. Of course. Everything about me is big. That's funny. I was just thinking, what big eyes you've got. All the hmm. better for seeing how you ain't got my wine yet. Get going. We have the wine. <laughs> Fine. <clears throat> Ciao. Give him the wine. Give him the wine. You see, you could have... If you would, would have walked over here, then you would have gotten... Oh, yeah. Hey, look at that. We got a little, little FMV action. How did he... Wait a minute, he pulled the... Um, oh, he's got it. We're getting seen. He pulled the whistle out before he realized it was bad wine. That's bad continuity there. <laughs> okay, Jim. Okay, Christopher Lloyd, you're, you're in a boiling cauldron. Don't worry. Make your boiling uh, cauldron face. Here in a jiffy. Uh, baby, it's been a silly mistake. We seem to have fallen into your soup. You lost me. What was the mistake? Well, huh, I mean, Flux and I clearly don't belong in this cook pot. We're, you know, still alive. Drill, don't give him any ideas. Now listen, BB. You know, it sort of breaks prototype to be on a first name basis with dinner. Let's go back to the Mr. Wolf thing. Listen, Mr. Wolf, it's getting really, really warm in here. That's the idea. 
That's the idea. Queen Yu is going to be very unhappy. That Joker wouldn't be unhappy if he saw his mother get flatulent by a bus. Besides, he's got what? no authorship in these woods. Out here, I am king. And you are dinner. Okay, I think it's time to move on to plan B. What was plan B? Help! Again? Coming up with plan C. I was afraid of that. Okay, you gotta give him the... There's a th thing in our inventory that... But we don't have access to our inventory. Oh. Yeah, we're toast. Uh, okay, then try to grab something. Maybe that poker. Oh! Hi. You can rock the, the pot. Wait, so the, the only interactable element over here is just the big bad wolf? Yeah. Uh, something about the carrot? Oh, looks like you're doing it. How many times you have to do it before it goes? I think. He... Oh, I know what to do. Look in the. We, oh, we don't have access to our. Wow! How many times does it have to go? Sure got rid of the wolves. And not to mention all my muscle aches. Now my shoes are full of soup. <laughs> hey Noah, have you ever played the Ace Ventura point and click adventure game? I never knew there was one. Um The Wolves dinner yeah. table. Crushed. About the fire. All right, we got a book. A hot fire. Hmm. A hot fire. As opposed to a cold fire. Even quite the inventory here. The recipe for squirrel love. Oh dear. Uh. Okay. Ah, trusted henchman. Enter. Come, Come in, Majesty. Majesty. I need you to take care of a meddler. Another Qtopian? No, this meddler is an alien. <gasps> and he is not alone. He travels with a Zanian. Oh, don't worry, your monstrousness. We'll get you. I never said I was worried. No, of course not, your excellency. Sorry. Find them at once. 
and lock them away. Uh, uh, forgive me, Majesty, but for how long? Well, gosh, I don't want to seem unreasonable. So how about forever? <laughs> Lock them away. <laughs> okay, um, let's go back into that room. I just looked at the uh, my little walkthrough. We, there's a thing we would never have seen, and we should probably do it. Okay. So, go to the inventory and put the. Put the corn in the in the uh, pot. You're right. What? I would never have thought of that. The Why Swift to Falcon make popcorn? Ten dollars. Uh -huh. Glad to see you guys streaming together again. This game is insane. I like it. Smile. Insane is an understatement. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Who was uh, that? It's that, not that, that. working. It's not working. No. It says give the wolf the wine. Click on the left, right. Put the corn cob on the fire to get popcorn. Put the that spit cool. back before. Can I you remember. put the? Uh... I'll try this at home. Okay, there you go. You did it. Now put the spit back before putting the dough onto it to make a roll. Well, there you go. I'll put it back. I guess. I don't know why we took it off in the first place. I'll just put this back where I found it. Now put the roll on it. In the dough on it to make a roll. I'm not sure we put I guess we put it on there. No, oh, I think you need to pick it up, then place it. Yeah. Now you got your thing. Wow. Hey, what? Take the spit again when you're done. Hold Any on to bake? the spit. So take Any it and put barbecue? it in here. You can keep the spit and the... Oh, now you have that for a weapon. Spit base. Okay, so now you should be good. Okay. How do I let's save? Let's, uh, let's save now. Yeah, it's 2 o'clock. We should press apply a good time to save and Why stop. Take it? Yeah. Call it a day. Nice work. Okay. End of live stream to you. Oop. And let's go over to the scene. Yeah, that would be fun to... Uh, yeah, that would be great to get a hold of Christopher Lloyd and get him to do a live stream or something of him playing this game. That would be, that would blow up the internet. It would blow up this much of the internet. Do you think he even remembers doing Toonstruck? Like, I wouldn't. If, if I had a career like his. I'm sure he would say, oh, yeah, I did a couple days on this video game way back when. I'm sure he'd have like a that kind of a memory of it. I presume he remembers King's Quest better. He did that? It, the yeah, voiceover did, for that? He did uh, the King's Quest sequel from 2015. Oh, okay. So so that's, that's much good. more recent, so he might remember that. But, you know, I, I always figure that these people really like to talk about... You know, they're sick and tired of talking about their most popular projects that they yeah. talk about all the time. And talking about obscure projects or things that they aren't usually asked about is much more interesting. I think I agree. Really fun. Yeah, I always like being asked about stuff I don't normally get asked about because uh, you know answering the same questions all the time is it gets tiring. It does, um, yeah. I mean, um, that's my mo in my interviews. When I so well, for example, when I interviewed Clint Pachekin, who's the composer of Outlaws, and he's it's his most popular soundtrack. We talked for five hours and we talked about five outlaws hours, wow. for 10, 10 minutes. So <laughs> I think that talking about the less known projects is much more interesting. That's yeah, it. Daniel, uh, you're lucky. Uh, you're lucky you talked to me instead of Daniel. No, otherwise he'd have, he'd have kept you for five <laughs> plus hours. He doesn't do short. Uh, this guy doesn't do short interviews. I'm the opposite of TikTok. Exactly. Exactly. All right. Well, this is fun. Um, it will yeah. just, I think for now, with the plan, unless we all change our minds, but I'm still enjoying this, uh, is to just continue this on our Mondays. This will be our Monday stream until okay. until we finish. Um, we might 
play some uh i don't know what we're doing for sure on friday we might do, go just sort of have like a a chill day and play some uh uh jackbox or something Tom like that w3, so i'll let you know tip ten dollars uh, good to see you free again you're up for it. here's ten dollars uh, to never again go into the bovine bondage bordello we have to at some point yeah. we have to <laughs> we'll have Sorry, to refund <laughs> Thank you so much for your donation. Thanks, everybody. We got close to our goal today, uh, and we appreciate all your support. And uh, if we get to our goal on Wednesday, we'll do a Wheel of Curtis. Um, I might I might jump on tomorrow and do a solo stream of, uh, I'm thinking of playing that game, uh, The Beginner's Mind, the guy that... Uh, the guy who created Stanley Parable. That's a, It's a short version. Oh, The Beginner's Guide? Game. Beginner's Guide. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Did you play that? I've heard of it. I've never yeah, me too. It. Yeah, I've heard good things. Or I heard interesting things, and I certainly like Stanley Parable. So, so if I have some time tomorrow, I might hop on. I'll let you guys know. Just keep an eye out on, on the social media channels and and all that. And uh, and otherwise, Daniel and I are back on Wednesday with what are we playing? I have no mouth, and I can't and scream. I must, and I must scream. My, and must scream. Like, yeah, yeah. People have been asking us about that for a long long time they've been lots of requests for us to play a game so we're going to give it a try daniel thinks okay. it's too wordy for me yeah, he might regret get, it might regret it but we'll it's, see uh, it's it's heady stuff but uh yeah it may not be for everybody um, yeah well i'm super curious i've heard enough about it now that i need to at least give it a give it a look so so stay tuned and we'll be back uh maybe tomorrow and for sure on wednesday and uh and maybe something a little more open-ended on Friday. So we'll let you know, know what's going on and, and you let right. us know what your availability is. Okay. Take care guys. See ya. See ya. Bye. Bye. Damn. Shazam just got here.